A Romero motion is basically where we go before the judge and, and we ask the judge in, in his discretion to strike or, or remove one or more of our client's strikes uh, so that the client is in a better position in terms of sentencing or potential sentencing. And, and to give you an example, suppose that I have a, a client named John who is, is facing a three strike sentence and he has two prior strike convictions. If I can go before the judge and convince the judge to strike one of those strikes, then instead of being sentenced as a three striker, he would be sentenced as a second striker. Uh, and instead of facing 25 to life in state prison, he might be facing just a few years. If I can convince the judge to strike both of those strikes, uh, then John would not be sentenced as a striker at all. Uh, but he'd be sentenced to, uh, uh, to a normal felony, uh, and, and he'd even be eligible for probation. Now, when we make a Ramiro motion, basically we, we write a written motion that we, that we provide to the court, and then we have a hearing where we make oral arguments to the judge. And what we want to do is, is really show the judge that, um, that the strike priors are not that serious, that maybe they, they occurred a long time ago, uh, maybe nobody got hurt, Maybe they sound more serious than they are. Maybe our client really played only a very minor role in the crime. We also want to show that the new case is not that serious. Uh, again, that, that you know, nobody got hurt, nobody had a monetary loss, that our client played only a minor role. A and we want to really humanize our client. We, we, it's very easy for a, a prosecutor or a judge to, to look at a file and say, well, this is a habitual criminal, uh, just, just a name on paper, Let, let's, let's uh, send him away. But if we can get the judge to see this client as a person, as somebody who has a family, who has children, who has parents, who um, is involved in the community, who's employed, who has hopes and dreams and fears, then uh, it's much easier uh, to get the judge to exercise that discretion to strike strikes, or remove strikes from his record. And when we do that successfully, uh, many times we can uh, take a client who's looking at 25 to life, 50 to life, uh, uh, sometimes get them just a few years, sometimes even get them probation with no time at all.